we think of the internet computer as an extension of the internet itself that is carrying on the legacy of the internet. The internet computer isn't just this virtual computer. It's a complete stack where you build software in a new way. First of all, we want to support autonomous software. Uh, autonomous software is software that doesn't have an owner, that runs on the internet computer. We want to enable people to build systems that are secure by default. Uh, software systems built on the internet computer uh, come with the same kind of security guarantees that we've seen uh, provided by smart contract systems. Thirdly, of course, we want to free captive customers. Complexity is the business model of the legacy IT stack. It's all about making captive customers. The fourth piece is just about reducing complexity. Um, the internet computer reimagines what software is. We aim to enable people to build IT infrastructure at much lower cost. We've decided to start pushing things out into the public domain, starting with the Definity Canister SDK. Please. Yes. We've also been working on a new computer language. It's called Motoko. So I'm pleased to announce uh, the Motoko uh, language. So this last year, Definity has done a lot of growing. Um, our research and development team is up to about 60 people spread out across three different offices. We've got a research center in Zurich, San Francisco, and Palo Alto. We've hired world-class researchers, but we have had a missing ingredient from our success, uh, and that ends tonight, and that is you. And the first thing that we are releasing is the Definity Canister SDK. They're essentially a conceptual container for your applications. It comes with a, uh, a demo app. You can just run it, it's Hello World. And as I mentioned before, this is a conceptual container. So this is not actually running on one machine somewhere, one server, even a group of servers if you're deploying that way. It's really your code is striped across the entire protocol. It's running throughout the entire network. It's almost haunting the network as opposed to running on it. Uh, we're really aiming to make this familiar, uh, not revolutionary. Now that it's out and now that it's like in your hands, now you could expect updates pretty fast. One of the things that Dominic talked about and we talk about a lot at Definity is that we are aiming to replace the legacy IT stack. For starters, we're getting rid of databases. Throw them out, right? You don't need them. You don't need them. You can just declare your data structures, as I've done. You can populate them, and then you can just move on with your life. The internet computer, through a series of snapshots and message replay, just remembers. It retains the state of your application. That's why this canister contains your code and your state. And this is kind of like the first stop on the train to the future. If you can see the vision, then I have a, a favor to ask of you. If you are excited about the internet computer, download the SDK, write something cool, right? Something that you want to see in the world, right? And if you're still excited after that, then Tell people, show people, uh, show people what you've made, get them excited about the internet computer, get them to write something that they want to see in the world. We uh, are trying to build a different world, a different internet, and we want people to re-engineer internet services in open form using something called autonomous software that the internet computer supports so that they become part of the fabric of the internet itself.